everybody, welcome back to On Air with St. Clair. Today we're at the St. Clair College Sports Park and we're going to be interviewing with Kevin Corriveau, the coordinator of the Sport and Recreation Management Program. Thanks for joining us, Kevin. Can you tell us a bit about the program? Well, it's a three-year advanced diploma here at St. Clair College at our South Campus. It's really a, a primarily a program for students who are interested in making their careers out of their love for sport and recreation, whether it be community-based, private, or public sector, sports, recreation facilities, you name it, it's for students who really have a passion for the recreation and sport idea and want to make it their career and their livelihood. So that's what this program really is all about. Emily, can you tell us a little bit about um, your experience at St. Clair College in the program? Thanks, Rosie. My experience with the St. Clair College Sport and Recreation Management Program, I was able to take classes like techno marketing, facility management, and recreation program planning, and this really helped aid in my knowledge in developing recreation programs today. Can you tell us a little bit about how you came to choose St. Clair? I'm an international student from India, and I've been in sports all my life. I knew St. Clair College has an amazing facility and amazing uh, faculty, so that is the reason I chose it and I knew it's the greatest choice I could ever make. So what are some of the things that you cover in this program? Primarily it's about the business of sport and recreation. So they'll be doing things like uh, your standard accounting, uh, let's see, we'll be doing marketing, sport marketing, sport management, um, facility management, all business concepts tied directly into sport and recreation. Uh, when they're finished here. So they'll cover the gamut of what most actual business students would actually cover while they're here, but we concentrate and make sure they enjoy it based on their interests, which are getting into sport and recreation and the management business side of either one of those industries. How did your experience at St. Clair College prepare you for the working world of sport and recreation management? So the classes that I just listed, those helped aid in my knowledge in marketing and program development. Now I am developing programs for the town of Tecumseh and furthermore I will be moving to a new position with the town of LaSalle in aquatics and fitness to continue to develop programs and market to the community. So how has your time at St. Clair College been helping you so far? Ever since I've started with the college, I have had amazing opportunities to work around the city and today I'm working with the town of Tecumseh and I'm really, really excited about it. Are there any uh, opportunities for students to transfer to other schools after they graduate from St. Clair College to further their education in this field? They can go to Ireland for a one-year sport management degree at IT Carlo or Tralee. They can then, if they want to, they can engage at Davenport University. Uh, we have an agreement there. They can actually go to the Grand Rapids campus there and one year achieve their sport management degree. They can do it online, stay right here at home and uh, work in whatever job they happen to be working at uh, and continue on with their educational opportunities. And a brand new one just to be announced for this September is actually an agreement with our very own University of Windsor, a partnership that's been formed with this program and the sport management program at University of Windsor. They finish their three year advanced diploma here at St. Clair. They can go to University of Windsor, two more years, we'll get them their sport management and a leadership degree. So we're very excited about those opportunities for our students in regards to recruitment, our athletes, and of course, they'll come here, we have a great time, we engage them, work integrated learning. Um, part of what they'll do towards the last part of this program is working out there in the field, and then they go to university and continue on with their education if they're interested. That's great, Kevin. So I guess the only question left is what can students look forward to in the field as far as career opportunities go as soon as they finish this program? I guess they have a couple of opportunities. They can continue, continue on with their education, as we just mentioned, and then seek employment in the field of sport and recreation once they're finished with that, or directly from here, they can engage themselves in a number of opportunities, whether it be sport, provincial organizations, national organizations, our national sport organizations. So there's lots of opportunities. The recreation industry has indicated right now that in the next probably four to five years, there'll be a lot of openings based on uh, attrition in that industry. So we're looking forward to our students engaging themselves that way. Thanks for joining us, everybody, for On Air with St. Clair. Make sure to follow us on YouTube, TikTok, Instagram, Twitter, and Facebook. Bye now. We're here with Emily, who's a reach, recent a regent. Um, <laughs> Thanks, Rosie. <laughs> <laughs> How has your studies at St. Clair College helped you so far? Um, rats. Okay.